Sandy Road where it's all open and empty. There's only so far you can go before the police find you. You're bound to be caught. They're never going to catch me. Not where we're going. You know where we're going? We're not just driving to get away? from off my cart. We better call the police. What for? I'm not gonna do nothing about somebody getting a free room for the night. There's a statewide manhunt for an escaped con with light brown hair. Look, I told you I didn't have much. And you were right. <laughs> But uh, thank you anyway. We really appreciate you trying to give us some help. You look, if anything else comes to mind, if you think of anything, I mean, it, even his childhood, you know. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, Zach. Uh, you take care of yourself. Wait, yo, yo, pal. What? This is really weird, man. I just... I just thought of this one thing. I mean, it's probably nothing, but... Why don't you let us decide that? Well, Todd used to talk about his mother. What do you mean? She, she's dead, right? Yeah, yeah, but, but sometimes late at night, out of nowhere, he'd just, he'd start telling me these stories about her. Todd's mother died when he was a teenager. Yeah, but you see, you'd never know it by the way he talked about her. I mean, it was weird. His, his voice got all soft and fuzzy. Every time he brought her up, and it was like, it was like somebody switched the radio station. What did he say about her? Just, you know, stuff. Like, like, like what? Zach, this could, this could be important. I, did he ever talk about what she used to do or what she used to say? Canoeing. What? Canoeing, yeah. He said his mom was like this world-class canoeist, but th that she could do any sport. Okay, well, his mother was athletic. Um, anything else? She liked to fish, too. Um, to fish? Uh, look, I, yeah, I told you I didn't have... No, no, hang on, hang on. Uh, when Todd talked about his mom, did he ever mention a specific place in connection with her? Yeah, yeah, a summer house. It, that's where he said she did most of her canoeing. It was, um... And he, she also took him fishing once. And it was on, uh, it was on some river near the Great Lakes. This was her house? Yeah, it was her and her, uh, her second husband. Wait a minute, wait a minute, that's it. That's it. I remember Todd once went into this whole rap about running away from summer camp and when he was like 11 or something and that he, that he took off on the bus to go see his mom at that house. What did Todd say about when he saw his mom? Well, he just said that it was the greatest time of his life and that it was really hard for him to handle when, when he got sent back. I mean, he never saw her again. I know exactly where we're going. Totally over the edge. 
hostage. He's got Rebecca as a hostage. I know that you think that I'm some kind of monster, but you used to see good in me, didn't you? How far do person that I trust. And what did you do? You tried to leave. What are you going to do to me? It's the end of the road. One life to live. Everywhere. Todd Manning hasn't shown. No luck with aerial surveillance but, either. Come on, the guy is out there someplace. And he's got Rebecca Lewis with him. Now my guess is he's gonna double back to someplace familiar to him. Hey, hey! I think we gotta lead. No, or not now. I'm in the middle of something. Forget the map. Forget anything else you've heard, Hank. We've come up with a lead. We think we know where Todd's taking Rebecca. You didn't have to do this. Yeah, I did. I'm sorry about what happened at the motel. Yeah, you're sorry, all right. Sorry you didn't escape. <sighs> I was scared. I'm sorry. I promised you. Don't promise me anything, okay, Rebecca? I trusted you once. Never again. No, but you can trust me, okay? I was scared. I'm not scared anymore. I won't panic if you just... Get these handcuffs off. I'll take the handcuffs off as soon as we get... What is it? Where are we going? Nowhere. I've got the roadblock. Hold on. Doc, what are you trying to do? Are you trying to kill us? What am I supposed to do, huh? Drive up to the roadblock, shake hands with the state troopers? How do you know it was even a roadblock? It could have been an accident. Or somebody could have just had a flat tire. Yeah, well, tire. I'm not taking any chances, okay? I turned off that highway just in time. We're safe now. Safe? Safe? Do you hear yourself? You're on the run and you dragged me along and now we're lost on some back country road in the middle of nowhere. We're not lost. You know where we are? I know where we're going. You keep saying that, but it's so dark and there are no signs. It won't be long. How can you be sure? Look, how can you be sure that we didn't t take a wrong turn or he didn't... Hey, Rebecca, relax. I can find this place with my eyes closed. I think if I concentrate, I can even hear it. Todd associates a lot of good times with his summer house. You see, the house belonged to his mother and his stepfather, and, 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 and it's very important to him. Oh, yeah. According to that paragon of honesty, Zach Rosen. Zach had no reason to lie to us, Hank. Give me a break. The man is in prison, and you helped put him there. We're, we're not saying that he's a changed man, And Hank. he did he did seem sincere. He knows what Todd might do to Rebecca if we don't find him first. All right. Fine. Assuming that he is telling the truth, What's so special about this summer house? Todd's always thought of it as this great place, a, a long way from his father and his troubles at home. Well, he ran away from camp just to be there, with, to be with his mother. And where is there? I mean, oh, did Zach forget to tell you that part? He only knew that it, it, it's n north of here, near one of the Great Lakes, uh, someplace in the woods or something. Oh, well, that really narrows it down. I mean, Wisconsin, Michigan, upstate New York, Canada. Come on, Why give me a Why are you being so negative? I'm not being negative. Yes, I'm you being are. realistic. Now, look, I'm not just, I'm not saying you guys can give it a good try, okay? Try? Hank, we're giving you your first real lead here. And where exactly does it lead? The house could be anywhere. Well, Zach said it was on a river. What river, Nora? The Hudson River? One of the other 200 rivers between here and the Great Lakes? Well, well try calling Todd's father in Chicago. He, he might... Come on, Paul. We just had this conversation. Todd's old man washed his hands of the kid the day he was thrown into prison. He's been uncooperative from the very start. Now... The, the stepfather. Call the stepfather. I know the mother's dead, but you could contact the stepfather. Well, I would really like to... Would you get that for me, please? 
What's the guy's name? Where does he live? Assuming that he is alive. <laughs> 